All right, so after the quarterfinals completing today for the Rome Open for 2023, and a big, big result with Rabakina getting through against Fiontech with a retirement. Let's have a chat about the Fiontech injury because it was not looking good. In the tiebreak, she kind of hurt herself. Fiontech then was crying after the tiebreak, went to get a medical timeout. Let's go have a look at what the injury was and get a little bit more of info into what might be happening in the future. So having a look at this photo here, you can see once she got out of the medical timeout, after the second set tiebreak, she had heavy strapping on her thigh and was really struggling to get back the returns and also moving around on the court in the early parts of the third set. So we haven't heard official word yet from Fiontech, but looking at this photo here, you can see there the thigh was definitely compromised and really affected her movement. So there it is. The thigh looks like the problem. It could be front of the thigh, could be back of the thigh. We're not sure yet. We'll wait until Fiance gives us some more details on that one, but it's not good for the French Open champion of last year to have to defend a title now with an injury. And of course, she was the Rome champion the last two years as well. So having to retire a tournament that she's won twice already in the last couple of seasons is not good. Let me know down in the comments below. How do you think Fiontech's going to go? Do you think maybe the retirement was a precautionary one because she wants to play the French Open and get ready for that and not risk getting hurt more? Or do you think she is in jeopardy of not playing the French Open? I mean, that would be such a shame. But Fiontech has to retire against Rabakina in the Rome Open.